Wait, what? What's that? A toilet? We a plug? No, it's actually a plug frog. What? <laughs> it leaped up in the air. What? Oh my god. <laughs> What is going on guys? My name is Finitex and today I am bringing you Pokemon Clover. This game's been around for quite some time, I do believe. I looked it up on YouTube, a few people have played it, uh, but I was just looking down the um, ROM hacking um, website. And I wanted to go ahead and play a ROM hack because I've not done it since Pokemon Life has ended and Pokemon Gaia version. Uh, so also I wanted to go ahead and do this. Uh, but it seems pretty interesting. Um, I've had a look at the Pokemon you can capture. It's all fake one uh, and it seems pretty funny. So um, I just decided to go ahead and play this for you guys. If you could give it a thumbs up right below the video as it's greatly, greatly appreciated. And comment down below in the comment section if you'd like to see me play some more of this at the end of the video. Anyways, 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 let's jump into this. Let's jump into this. Welcome to Pokemon Clover, a VP fan project. Clover is a group effort put together by add-ons from across the globe. This is our first demo version going to Actuvid City, which is Cerulean. Alright, so the demo goes all the way up to Cerulean, which is quite decent. Uh, press the... Press the A button again. Alright, let's do this then. <laughs> Yo, what the hell? What happened to this guy's leg? Was this guy a pirate? I got a pirate professor? Yo, who knew wears a pink top? Oh, look at that chest hair, though. Look at that straight, bald cut. He's got a scar on his head. Yo, this guy looks like he's been through the war and everything. And I'm Professor St <laughs> Professor Stump. Because what better name to give a guy with a stump like than Professor Stump? I'm the professor here in Fuchim region. Uh, this... Yo, what? Even the Pokemon looks retarded. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, for some people, Pokemon are pets, other people battle with them. As for me, I study Pokemon and make 45 grand a year with the shit benefits. <laughs> what? Uh, but we ain't here to talk about me. I want to hear about you, kid. Oh my god, are you a boy or a girl? I'm fucking blind over here. What? Yo, what happened to this pale skin, though? I look like a ghost. Alright, kid, what's your name? Oh my god. This guy, I prefer fucking stump. This is so funny. Okay, so you know he's faint, right? Of course he does. Hey, look at this guy. I can feel his edge from here. What? You can feel his edge from here? He looks like he's got a stick up his ass and couldn't get it. <laughs> he's got one up his ass. Uh, hey, you in the black, what's your name? Uh, we'll give this guy Blade. Blade, huh? Whoa, Blade. Don't get all pissy, I only ask you name. <laughs> Yo, this game can't be serious. Faint, you're 10, you're young, and you're tough. Now get out there and go. A world of dreams and adventures of Pokemon awaits. Good luck, kid. Yo, this game can't be serious. This game cannot be serious. Oh, I, I like I like the sprite they did. All right, so I guess I'm going to just withdraw the potion, uh, considering we do that every single time. Let's talk to mum. Right, all boys leave home someday. It says so on the TV. Oh, yes, Professor Stump next door was looking for you. Okay, thank you. And I'm guessing if it's just based off the original games, then we gotta go up here. Hey, hey, what the hell do you do? You think you're doing? Yo, look at Professor Stump's sprite. <laughs> you can see his peg leg. Do you want to get your ass handed to you? Wild Pokemon live in the tall grass. You need your own Pokemon for your protection. Hey, I know. Yo, look at the stump leg though. It's moving. Yo, how can you move a stump leg that fast? That makes no sense. That makes no sense. All right, Blade. I'm fed up with waiting. Hey, Faint and Blade. Oh yeah, I told you to, to come give me a sec here, Faint. There are three Pokemon here. Uh, what do you mean you don't see them? The Pokemon are on the table, you idiots. <laughs> what? When I was your age, I was a serious Pokemon trainer, but now I sit here in a freaking lab and give away reject starters to kids. You can have one, go on, pick one. Blade. Which one of these is a dark type? None of them, you Nignog. <laughs> Nignog, seriously? Oh my god, yo, I can't take this game for- I can't take this game serious. Alright, let's have a look at the starters. Yo, this is grass hole. Yo, why has he got a fucking leaf coming out of his ass? Oh, it hits like a brick. No, I don't want that one. A jet chasm? It's kind of- oh god, that- why base it off sperm? Yo, this is arable. <laughs> it's probably illegal to own in a few countries. <laughs> We are taking that guy, and I know what I'm calling. I could go with a so bad nickname. 
Ah, uh, but I'm not gonna do that. I'll go for something even worse. <laughs> Hello, Akuma. Oh, Jekaza. I can't take this game. I can't take this game serious. Do you really think you'd leave here without battling me? Ha, there's no escape. Oh my god, this game. Alright, Rival Blade, a uh, Jet Cousin. Oh, for Pete's sake, so pushy as always. Faint. You kids better not fuck up my lab. You pay for anything you break. You never had a Pokemon battle before, have you? A battle. A Pokemon battle is when trainers battle their freaky Pokemon. It's pretty self explanatory. Uh, the trainer that makes the other trainer's Pokemon faint by lowering their HP to zero wins. It's not that hard to get the hang of, just don't fuck up my lab, you bastard. <laughs> <laughs> How can this game be serious? Yeah, knock the piss out of the hat. <laughs> what? Yo, I feel sorry for you guys watching this. This is so bad. Alright, Aluark Maz level 6. Wow, what? Unbelievable. Hmm, excellent. If you win, you earn prize money and your Pokemon will grow. Battle of the Trinity to make your Pokemon strong. What a worthless Pokemon. Farewell, Faint. Farewell, Stump. Yo, this game is too much. Uh, did we heal? Yeah, he healed us. Alright, cool. Yo, let's have a look at Aluak Bar. Yo, we got a powerful Ember, though. I think we get a town map, don't we, from you? Nope. Okay. Anyways, let's head out onto Route 1 and. Squirry Rap, really? They put a snapback and a microphone on this guy's tail. This does not get any more stupider. Yo, full credit to the people that made these games, but I'm I'm sorry, you you can't do that to a Pokemon. You cannot do that. Kenjion? What the hell? This like it looks like one of those wind up toys you get from like Toys R Us. What the hell? Oh my god, this game's too much. I I can't even play. It. I oh my god, I I'm worried to find out what else is in store in this game. Ah. <sighs> Alright, let's go to the Pokemon Center, we'll heal up, um, and then I think we've got to pick up the package, like normal. Uh, yep. Alright, sweet, that's all that done. That's pretty much it, we just head back to the lab. Yo, I can't take this Kenji on seriously, man. And the fact that the Professor's got a stump leg is just so amazing. Looks like he needs to be a pretty good trainer. Yo, what's that, you got something for me? Yeah, we got the Stumps Parcel. Hey, that's my fancy ass new aluminum peg leg. Really? I bought this shit on Amazon like a week ago. Overnight delivery, my ass. <laughs> Thanks, so, kid. Oh my god, what do you want for me? Oh yeah, I got a job for you too. On the desk over here, there are Pokedex I ordered. It automatically records data on a Pokemon you've seen or caught. I'm giving you these two of these because I got an email a week ago from the International Pokemon Research Committee saying they ain't gonna jack shit data on Fulchin's Pokemon. Apparently, the people in this region were too lazy fucks that they never did a species survey. The shit I gotta put up with. Oh my god, this game is so funny! Like, seriously, what? Uh, you can get detailed data on Pokemon just by looking at them. You gotta catch them to complete data. So here are some balls for catching wild Pokemon. When a wild Pokemon appears, it's fair game. Just throw a Pokeball at it and try to catch it. This won't always work though. A health Pokemon can escape, you gotta be lucky. Now from what I hear, there's something like 150 Pokemon in this region. Uh, that's... yeah, that's right. I want you to catch them all. Now I would do this myself, but I'm an old cripple bastard. <laughs> So I want you to get this shit done for me. Get moving, you two, and hurry because Dr. Promfet is gonna cut my benefits again. Oh my god! Yo, this game is not PG at all. It is not. Yo, Squirrel Rap, why? And he had Growl, really. If I had a Pokemon move called Rap, I would like, lose my shit. Alright, Luak Maz level 8. Yo, I've seen the I've seen the Pokemon these as these like and I've just been looking at them now. And the Alu the um Arrow Bomber or whatever I got is like he's like second evolution's quite cool. To be honest. Uh should we go pick up the item? Oh yo! They're like in a little pocket like in a little pouch that you keep like normally like you know like what Brock keeps all the food in and shit. They look pretty sweet. Alright, let's have a look what we can encounter on What the hell is that? New Eason? Yo, it's burnt. Should we catch that thing? Yo, I'm gonna catch this guy. Hey, new Ethan. Um, let's go. This guy pretty much looks like he's depressed with life, so. 
I'm gonna call him Emo Bird. Which I think is the appropriate name for this guy. Screw it up! No, you can get... What else? Kinjion? Is there anything else that appears in this route? No, just a square wrap. The emo bird. Another emo bird. Alright, I don't think there's anything else. Why did I go doorway? Is there an item down here? No, there isn't. I thought there was for some reason. Alright, so let's make our way back to the Pokemon Center. We got emo bird. A fucking emo bird. And um, a bomb. Which is absolutely amazing. Uh, let's go buy some Pokeballs. And we'll buy some potions. We'll buy an antidote and we'll buy... Paralyze heal. Uh, I'll buy two more of you. Alright, so let's make his way up to what's this city called? Uh, Vitala City. So I'm guessing it's going to be like Vitala Forest. Because uh, they swapped it out for, um, what is it, Viridium. All you kids today just use the internet or something. Uh, hey, let me give you advice. Whenever you catch a Pokemon, the Pokedex automatically updates its data. You don't know how to catch Pokemon. I suppose I'd better show you then. Alright then. Yo, what? Fri Fridian? Yo, this looks like a piece of chicken with some wings. Yo, chicken wings! Yo, shout out to KFC right now. Alright, I think we know how you catch your Pokemon, dude. Now, that was educational, was it not? Here, take this too. We get the Tetch TV. Yo, we get the Tetch TV. Alright, we're in Route 2. I, I want to see what the hell else appears in here. Oh my god. What the hell? Wasn't that Beedrill's cry? Crewy crawl, what? Uh, I just want to train Eluak Bar up just a little bit. I, I kind of interested just to see- Oh my god. Screwy fucking rap. I'm just interested to see what Pokemon there actually is in this game. I want to put Emo Bird up to the front. There we go. Uh, we never really looked at Emo Bird, did we? Yo, it's poison! And he's got liquid ooze? Yo, that's not even bad. There we go. Alright, let's head into the forest. Oh my god, this is gonna be funny. What did what, she say? Squirrel rat may be small, but don't understand me. It's wicked rhymes. Have you caught one already? No. Nope. Uh, it's natural amazing there. Be careful you don't get lost. Okay. Yo, we're in Viridium Forest. Well, that's a forest. Or whatever it's called. I was throwing Pokeballs into catch Pokemon and I ran out. That's why you can never have too many Pokeballs. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Oh my god, another Cruy Crawl. Yo, I want to see something else. Oh, what the hell? Lavidez? That looks quite cool. Yo, we got that liquid ooze though. Just go for another Absorb, bro. I mean, you're just going to get that to cough you. Why do I keep going String Shot? Really? Yo, I want to see what type of Pokemon these guys evolve into, so let me just quickly do this. Oh, here we go. So we got it up. Uh, so, oh my god, you're never going to believe what these stars' evolution names are. Alright, so the one that we could have started off with, Grassol, evolves into Analgay. And the third one evolves into Wreck Team. <laughs> oh, yo! Oh, the Arabomber evolves into Iguala, and the second and the final evolution is called Liz Lizakbar. Oh my God! Uh, the Edgechasm evolves into Horsejack, and the final one is Condoom. Wow, it is Condoom. Um, the Kruy Crawl we saw evolves into like a slice of pizza, and then it evolves into Gussy Fly. Lavidus evolves into a uh, Prosquito. Oh, the Clover Pokemon. Yo, that looks cool. Um, let's see if we can encounter it in here. Not Kruy Crawl. Uh, no, not you. We want Clo Clover or oh, whatever it's called. I don't know. I can't pronounce it. Let's try. Yo, why does Lava does? There we go. Uh, this evolves into the Pokemon we saw on the title screen. So I want to capture that Pokemon because it's Grass and Steel. And that just sounds actually really cool. So I think what I'm going to call this guy, since it's a Clover, uh, we're going to call this guy Lucky. We might as well, eh? Uh, let's heal Emo Bird up and Lucky. 
I might as well, al -Wakba. All right, let's have a wander through the fort. Wait, is that a Pokemon? The birdhouse is aggressive. Yo, this is actually a birdhouse with an eye on it. Yo, the attack on this thing! What? Come on, Aluakba. Hey, your birdhouse is down. Yo, it gives some decent EXP, though. Oh, but Emo Bird's dead. We can't have that. We cannot have that. Yo, this game is so funny. Like, seriously, you don't even want to know. There's a Pokemon called Armando and Muscle Dude and Triceps. That's that's how much creativity went into this game. Oh my god, this is going to be a lot. Oh, yo, there's another birdhouse there. Yo, I ain't battling that shit. That thing's too hard to take down. Uh, let's go to Clover. Let's have our first battle here. Hey, you have a Pokemon. Come on, let's battle him. Okay, man. Crewy Crawl at level 9. Yo, look how small Clover is. Uh, if I'm guessing it's like on the line, um, maybe this could be something that evolves kind of like a um, like a Caterpie. Let's have a look at Ember. Can we get him up there at level 5? Yeah, there's another birdhouse there. They, 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 them things are so scary to fight. But the Pokemon here are like level 11 already. And that is scary. It's like, I ain't got a clue what the, um... What do you call it? Yo, this is like the pizza with a broken eye. At level 13, are you kidding me? And it's got a citrus berry, really? Yo, look, he's level 6. Oh, I should have swapped out then. And that one had an armberry. So, Aluakbar is level 12. That's so wrong. Why am I doing this? Uh, we found an antidote as well. Lavidus. I gotta say, though, the game's promising. I mean, the Pokemon in here are promising. Very promising. Okay, it's got Bug Bite already. What? I just want to train Lucky up. He's got Vine Whip now. Oh, fuck you, Birdhouse. I don't understand how scary those Pokemon are. I mean, they're good for training up on, like, EXP. What? Pico... Pico Totten? What the hell? Really? It's got Sap Sipper. Boost attack if hit by grass. Yo, that's sick. Oh, you're not going to have any grass moves, though, are you? Uh, let's just go Ember. Look, he's level 8. Nope. I want him to hit me with grass to move, then. I think I need to train Emo Bird up, though. Alright, Ember, goodbye to you. Aluakbaz, 13. I wanted him to evolve. Alright, let's just get out of here. Another item. A potion. Found another potion. Okay, so the final train in here has only got a Lavidez. Uh, let's just go for a Ember. Let's go back to you, and I'm pretty sure that should be it. Yeah. Wait a sec. Oh no, I, I I wanted to go against the birdhouse, but I think screw that, because it'll just kill me. Alright, so we're finally here. Have you noticed the skinny trees on the roadside? They can be cut down by a special move, I hear. Ooh. Mini Pokemon living in only forest and caves. Okay. Yo, is this going to be... I think, yeah, this will just be the same Pokemon, like, down. He's level 9. Yo, this game... What the hell is this city called? Gardech City? Okay, well, that sounds intense. What the hell's that? Is this an attempt at, like, a recreation of Jigglypuff? Chili. Really? What? Team Karma is at Mount Moot? Huh? I'm on the phone. Well, 
that's that. But I think, guys, we're going to go ahead and wrap up today's episode here. Pokemon Clover. What is this game? I don't even know. This game looks so funny. Like, honestly, I cannot wait to keep playing this game and just see what is happening. But it's all down to you guys. If you want to see me continue this game, be sure to go ahead, give it a thumbs up, and leave a comment down below in the comment section if you guys want to see it. It'd be greatly, greatly appreciated if you could do that. I'd love to play this game some more. Just for the fact that it's actually really funny. Like, shout out to all the people that credited, like, to made the game. But it's so funny the Pokemon they've created is unreal. It really is. It looks so... They look so funny. And I'm sorry if I sound nasty, but they do. They do look so funny. It looks sick, though. It looks sick. Anyways, guys, I'm going to get out of here. Leave a like if you did enjoy. It's greatly, greatly appreciated. I've been Fit Attacks, and I will see all you guys in the next episode. Peace.